Uh, the nightmare, as you would say, uh, is someone that advocates for all business and, and activity after five. Raheem Manning's now that guy, though his official title is Philadelphia's director of nighttime economy and development. So I'm envisioning a, a 24 hour destination that is friendly and inviting and fun for those who live in Philly, but also open to the world and globally competitive, especially uh, with some of the cities that are on the East Coast. Manning's the first to hold the position, and his new role comes as the city rebounds from the pandemic, despite what seems like one empty business after another. Just ask Center City District President and CEO Paul Levy. We're back up to 82% of all retail establishments and restaurants open in Center City. Levy says retail sales are at 95% of pre-pandemic levels, while restaurant sales are a little lower at 85%. Foot traffic is also up. I've been in West Philly my entire life. Manning believes those deep roots give him a good understanding of what businesses, residents, and visitors are concerned about after hours. Like worrying about how people get to and from their establishment, worrying about what the lighting and design looks like around their establishment. Do people feel safe coming in and out? You know, you brought up safety. So, how do you entice people to come into the city late at night, especially during a time when people feel uneasy coming into the city? Yeah, I think, you know, we're at a time in, in this country where, you know, safety is a big thing. Mm -hmm. I think what I am here to do is to be an additional voice at the table for what that looks like for businesses that operate after five, for people that are moving through the city after five. On Philadelphia streets earlier tonight, opinions on the city's new efforts were mixed. Right now, the way it is, I don't, there's certain places I just won't go after dark. I think if the, we get the support, the actual infrastructure, it might be a good counter, um, counter to people who are afraid to come to Philly. Manning plans to hold listening sessions in the fall. I'm Brian Sheehan, NBC 10 News.